You're mine now. But how? <laughs> hey, what can I say? I'm just really flexible. So this formation's no good either, huh? I can't believe he's been able to dodge all of our attack. He should have taken a direct hit then. So how the hell was he able to evade every st I know I got him then, too. Yeah? Damn it, Shino. No one can even understand what you're trying to say. So I increased my field of vision with Byakugan. I surveyed the area for other chakra. Pass through. No wonder. Well, Kakashi? Shino. I know. These situations, hidden jutsu like Shino's are very useful. You're one of the Abarame Hey, Shino! What the heck? He's dodging every one of them! Scatter. Now wait just a second, guys! All right! Nice one, Shino! Come on. Still holding on to that grudge, huh? <laughs> Yamato. Got it. Ready to go whenever you are. What? The insects that were feeding off his chakra suddenly lost track of him. But that's impossible. Then he used some kind of transportation technique? No, that's not possible either. So he erased his whole body? He can wipe out his entire pre- And if that's the case, then he can erase the parts of himself that are targeted and would be struck by any external attack. <gasps> Found him! Over there! Pedaling Fang! Well? Tired of all this interference! Sasuke triumphed in the battle. Itachi Uchiha is now dead. Kidding. It's just as I expected. Hey! You up there! Spiky Aloe guy! Tell us where Sasuke is! We're just going to have to finish this some other time. Later. Yakugan! The forest's on fire, and it's burning with black flames. I'm a Tarasu. I'm not you. I simply can't shift as fast as you do. Good. I'll review it closely later. We're taking Itachi's corpse, too. So that's the Amaterasu. I've never seen it before. No way. What is all that? Earth-style planet splitter! Go on. You can proceed now. All right. Everyone else, follow me. So, it's all over then, is it? Yes, it's finally settled. So, where's Sasuke now? He's already been evacuated to a safe place. If Itachi isn't around anymore, I think I'll spread my wings and see where fate takes me. Oh man, what do you guys think happened here? I mean, what kind of battle could cause this amount of destruction? I detect no other chakra here. Aside from us, there's no one else in the area. Why can I never reach him? Why can't I ever catch up to Sasuke? I treated your wounds. <sighs> Try not to move unless it's necessary. Wait, I know those robes. You're with. I merely brought you here in order to tell you something. Maybe if I put it another way, you'll want to listen. It's about Itachi Uchiha. All right. Let me just start with a simple introduction then. Uh, no, it can't be. <laughs> what was that? Just now? The Amaterasu, which Itachi seems to have implanted in you. Leave it to Itachi to set a trap even after he's dead. I can't believe how well he planned. He probably set up this little trap so that the Amaterasu would automatically activate when you saw my Sharingan. So this was Itachi's final trick, huh? Too bad it didn't work on me. At the very end, for your sake, he managed to transfer his own visual prowess to you. He did it to protect you. 
I'll say it once more. You think you know all about your older brother, but you know nothing. I suppose that's only natural, hearing a story like this from a complete stranger. I am Madara Uchiha. Shut up! None of that matters anymore! Just get out of my sight, you hear me? And most of all for you, his younger brother. You will know how Itachi Uchiha... Because Itachi never wanted us to meet. Or to talk. With the Leafs Danzo, the third Hokage, and the two advisors Homura and Koharu, the truth about Itachi will fade into darkness forever. Just as Itachi himself wished. Apparently, he wanted to make doubly sure. It seems that Itachi didn't trust me. What are you trying to tell me here? Think back carefully and remember Itachi. Your kind and gentle older brother. That building is where father works, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It was the Uchiha clan's earliest ancestors who established the police force here in the Leaf Village. But even now, nearly all of us are a part of the force and work to uphold the peace in this village. Are you going to join the force too? Well, I'm not sure. Why not? My foolish little brother, Mangekyo Sharingan. <laughs> Don't touch me! <laughs> Sorry, Sasuke. Maybe some other time. Sorry, I took the liberty of tying you up since it didn't seem you'd stay still and listen to me otherwise. He killed our mother and father, and he slaughtered our whole clan. He was a rogue ninja. That fateful night. It is true that he slaughtered the entire Uchiha clan. And that is just the beginning of the truth about Itachi. It was his mission? In order to explain Itachi's story, I must take you back to the beginning. A problem that harkens back to the very origins of the founding of the Hidden Leaf Village. And on what ground should I believe you? You're completely untrustworthy. Fine. Talk. Nations fought for power, for the right to exist, or to expand their borders. And among all of these numerous ninja clans, were two that were feared above all others as the strongest. Excelling in all types of warfare, we became known as a battle. Back then I spent every day on the battlefield. In an era where power was everything, and with that power I fought the Senju clan more times than I can count. Hashirama Wood-style Senju, the future first Hokage, led by Hashirama, who became the very first to claim the title of Hokage. If a nation hired the Senju, their opponents would hire the Uchiha. We became rival. You stole your brother's eyes merely to heighten your own reputation? Is that what you're telling? Yes. As the Uchiha's reputation grew, my younger brother was fully aware and agreed with it. In fact, he volunteered his eyes. The majority on both sides had grown weary of the endless conflict. They had simply had enough. The Uchiha and the Senju were always like oil and water. I couldn't help fearing that one day, as their leader, I had no choice but to go along with their wishes. And thus the powerful system of one village to one nation came to be. But due to a certain incident, the Hidden Leaf's peace was short-lived. As you already know, the first to occupy that seat was Hashirama Senju. I knew that path would lead to a confrontation with Hashirama. My followers shunned me for trying to rekindle the flames of war and betrayed me. They scorned me as a selfish brother who stole his younger brother's eyes in order to save his own. <laughs> I'm sure even Hashirama believed that to be so. In order to prevent the rise of another traitor, Hashirama's younger brother and placed the entire clan under close scrutiny all in one fell swoop. Time passed. The leadership stayed in the Senju's hands. What I'd predicted came to pass. And then another incident sealed Uchiha's demise. What do you mean by that? But it was a spontaneous natural disaster. Uchiha had nothing to do with it. As a result, the Uchiha were put under strict surveillance by the Anbu Black Ops. And that was the beginning of the discrimination against us. The 
Uchiha clan started plotting a coup d'etat to take over the village. And that's when Itachi's suffering began.